Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to show you how to create this epic cool doodle based on the topic rainy day. So, I am going to use the app IBIS Paint X for this doodle. Let's get started. First, I am going to tell about the brush I have used. This is Hard Falcon Pen Brush. I have made some changes in the dynamic settings of the brush. Uh, so when I uh, give more pressure to the uh, S Pen, it's gonna go dark, um, thick line, and when I uh, reduce the pressure on the S Pen, it's gonna be thin down. So that's that are the settings I made on the dynamic settings. So first in the first layer, I'm using uh, the water appearance uh, to represent the rain. So I uh, made some curves to make it look like a wavy water and use some bright blue color. In the next layer above the water layer I am using, um, I am going to draw the paper boat. So sometimes I mista make mistakes and undo, undo, undo it. So I drawn this paper boat and I want it to be a little bit broader so I just use transform tool to uh, make it broad and I want it to be sinking a little bit so I just erase the edges of the boat and redone it. In the new layer I am going to draw the Maggie bowl. So this bowl uh, going to be uh, behind the water so I made this layer below of all the layers and I am using now I am using a magic wand uh, tool to draw the Maggie uh, only inside that bowl. So make it uh, look like it's only it is inside the bowl. So I am using two different yellow shades to make it look like more shaded one. And I am drawing the Maggie on the fork. So now I want it to be a little more doodle style so i am using the black color and making some outlines of for that uh, uh, maggie okay i like this now next i'm going to draw another in a new layer i'm going to draw the umbrella for this umbrella i have used lips tool to draw the circle and then i just erased half of it and using the falcon pen I'm going to draw the umbrella and I'm going to use bright red color for this and whenever you use colors and uh, using like one over the another make sure they are making a good contrast theme so now I have moved the umbrella behind the Maggie and I have yellow color and the umbrella have a red color so it makes good contrast if you are using the same color for the different objects and um, uh, placing one over the another it's going to look um, not, not that much appealing so make sure you have that contrast theme on your mind and choose the colors or if you if you made same colors and make sure you place it somewhere else not uh, behind uh, the same color so next i'm drawing the plant and i'm drawing the stones now and outline, outlining the stones with the black color and next i'm going to draw a ice cream so i just made this ice cream cone and adding some details to it and I'm getting pink color as and some chocolate over it so I want to be a little bit smaller so I'm just moving here and there and checking out where it fits well I want it uh, to be in front of the Maggie so I'm just moving it in front and I feel this is okay then next I'm going to draw the sun and cloud so since the red color is behind so I want it to be uh, mild 
and that's why I'm using mild blue color to make it good contrast and I'm just drawing some rain drops here and there okay this is fine next finally I'm going to add the text rainy day so for the rainy I'm using cherry bomb uh, font and this is available in the font itself and adding some uh, uh, you know outline for the training and for the day text i'm using b a l o o b a l o font and i have just added some background color like pale color then adding some rectangle in the background so this is the final look it looks really bright cool and more of doodle style so i hope you like this tutorial Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.